Hey everyone, today I have got really an unwrapping slash unboxing of this Travel Ease Contoured Bamboo Chunk Coal Memory Foam Pillow. So um, I'm going to be sort of travelling over the next uh, couple of weeks and also just for my bed as well actually. Uh, so I was after a new pillow because um, I tend to sleep on my side but I also sleep on my front as well so I tend to sleep really weird in how I sleep but um, I found with my current pillow it's really quite uncomfortable. So uh, I did some research and I found this pillow on Amazon uh, so I'll put a link below and um, this was basically kind of recommended in terms of something that is fitted, it's form fitted for your neck and also it's um, got this bamboo charcoal uh, kind of mixture inside it so it's supposed to be very cooling and it's also supposed to have some other benefits from having the charcoal in there um, that's supposed to be more relaxing and all stuff. I don't know if I necessarily believe that, but um, I bought this more from the purpose of the fact that um, it's kind of the shape really. So there's a couple of pillows on there that have got this shape, but this one had this kind of charcoal uh, and bamboo combination. So what I've got in here, I just literally just taken this out of the box. So this is what it comes with the, the box. It's in a nice little travel bag, which I can obviously take with me when I go traveling. Uh, and on the back, it shows kind of the different positions. Three reasons to select your premium bamboo charcoal. So it says, you know, the memory foam, it's natural organic bamboo charcoal, um, ventilated pillow covers. So it comes with a cover as well, which is great. It comes with two, which is awesome. So that's really good. Um, yeah, so, oh, anti-mite as well. I really like that idea because I, well, I kind of suffer from sort of dust allergies a little bit. Um, so this is kind of got anti-dust mite in there as well. So anyway, so what you get is in this kind of nice little hold all bag. Uh, I might struggle to do this with one hand, but let's have a look. So we've got on the top uh, a little knot. I'm just going to try and do this. And I'll obviously use this for a few weeks and let you know my thoughts on it at the end of this video, as I always do. Uh, so just bear me a second guys, I'm just going to undo this and I'll come okay, back. So I literally just undid the thing and start to pull this out. So it's actually folded over in half, so you can actually fold it and put it into this case. That's obviously says travel ease on this side of the case. And I'm just going to pull this out, so bear with me again as I uh, tackle with this one second. There we go. So, got it out the container, or the bag anyway. Um, it's slightly squished up, but that's okay. So it's got a couple of um, little notes on here. So you've got the dimensions on there as well, just in case you wanted to see that. And yeah, this is the kind of the shape of it. So let's have a look. So this, so that's the bottom. You see that's the top, and obviously this has got that kind of kind of I don't know little shape bit cut out of there. Nice soft material. Um, I will put another cover over this anyway, just a standard pillowcase cover. And yeah, it's reasonably chunky. It's kind of, so actually if you look from the side, you can see that it kind of goes from this kind of high position, goes lower, and your head will just kind of sit over this section here. And so if I just press my hand in, so it's not like crazy memory foam style, it kind of pops back up reasonably quickly, but it is nice and nice and soft. So that should be interesting to see how that's how I sleep on this. And I tend to sleep with two pillows. So I'll probably put this, I'll try it on top of one of my pillows, but it might be too high up. But I'll see how I go just with this pillow as well. Um, so there you go guys, just a quick unboxing. So I'm gonna use this for a couple of weeks and then I'll let you know my final thoughts on it. Catch Welcome you back everyone. So I've now had this pillow for over three months and I've just taken it out of the cover just so you can see what it looks like after through, using it for three months. And you can see it still maintained its shape. And you know, it, it's as comfortable as it was when I first bought it. I am really, really impressed with this. And I've actually recommended it to a few of my coaching clients that have got um, breathing difficulties and sort of nasal congestion at night, because I think, you know, and, and snoring. I think if you've got any of those problems, um, one thing to look into rather than just looking into, you know, increasing your breathing through nasal sprays or decongestants or steroid based um, sprays, is look into your neck position because if your neck is in an odd position when you're sleeping it's going to encourage snoring and what's good about this if you're a back sleeper it's going to pop your neck into a good position so that opens up your air airway so hopefully you reduce your snoring so that's one of the benefits anyway so i i am a side and front sleeper 
And I found this has been great to rest my head on this and sleep sideways. Um, it's been really, really comfortable. What I do sometimes is I usually prop it up with a pillow initially, so it's a little bit higher up when I initially go to bed. And during the night, sometimes I move that pillow and just have it flat so I can lie on my front. Um, so it is really, really comfortable. I am very, very impressed with this because it's a lot cheaper than things like Tempor and their pillows, which are a lot more expensive. Yes, it's not the same type of memory foam they use, but it's very, very comfortable and it's very supportive. So I do recommend it. It's worth giving it a try. As I said, I've got a link below um, if you want to look at this item and give it a go yourself uh, as it's from Amazon. But as I said, I've had no problems with this pillow. Very, very comfortable, very, very supportive. And I recommend it if you're a side sleeper um, or you sleep on your back. Um, it would be um, a, you know, great, great for your neck position. Um, and also potentially you can use it when you're sleeping on your front. Now when I am sleeping on my front, I tend to say sleep in this gap here. And when I'm on my side, I sometimes sleep here or I might even move over to one of these sort of more supported sides. So you can kind of use it in both, both ways really. Uh, but it just depends on what you get used to. Hope you find this useful guys. If you've got any questions or comments, leave them in the um, comments below and I'll do my best to answer. Cheers.